Last time on Galactic Football. Goal! And it's all over! The Xenons beat the Cyclops 3-0. If we play this team, we're dead. What? Rocket said he wasn't coming back. He says he doesn't need us anymore. Jock, you know better than anyone that we need Rocket to win the cup. You'll have to go back and convince him. Technoid will detain the Obia Moon Ambassador and his wife indefinitely. It's unclear why they were near the explosion. They're holding them like prisoners. Maybe I know someone who can help. I'll help you on one condition. If freed, your parents must tell the galaxy that I had nothing to do with the explosion on the Shadow's planet. I promise. When do we leave? Rocket? Arch wants you back. Tell Uncle Arch that I'm busy. John, there's only one way to get Rocket out of the sphere. You have to go in and beat him. And that's just what I plan to do. I guess you ate your veggies. Huh? Never eating the vending machine tamales again. Hey, Microwise, you're up early. Great. I guess you're as eager as I am to train. Yeah, you bet. I can't wait. That's funny. Now get out of bed and let's go. Hey. I think today is going to be a great day. Uh, huh? Uh, Jock, something tells me your good huh? mood might change soon. Don't worry. My father will clear his name. You'll see. He won't listen to anyone, Coach. It was a waste of time. Warren is going to try to play him, but... Rocket's someone else now. Someone who doesn't care. Hmm. I see. Well, um, what are we going to do, Coach? We're going to play, and we're going to win. Rocket or no Rocket. Mark, you're going to learn some of Rocket's special moves. It'll help the other players. I'll do my best. I want you both to remember that great teams face the unexpected without fear, and they fight back. That's the Snow Kids. Right, right coach. coach. Artegor, how are you feeling? Uh, much better, thank you. Have you got a moment, Arch? At her. She looks exhausted. She'd be better off in a cabin. Watch over her. Okay, Sonny. I still don't think it was a good idea to bring the girl along. I have a plan. You were the boss. It's the secure frequency. Sonny, am I interrupting? Clamp, what is it? I thought you should hear this. Sonny, 
Vrim Simra, the master of the Flux Society, told me that the explosion on the Shadow's planet was a Flux device. Do you know what that is? No, but I can guess. Uh, thank you for letting me know, Dame Simbai. Tell Clamp he was right about the invisible Flux. Be careful. Hmm, bad news. What it means, honey? It means that we now know what's behind Netherball, Flux. Blaylock is taking Flux from the Sphere. Only the Flux is somehow invisible in the Sphere. Then he's getting Flux from all of them. Gernor, Uambu, Lur, Rocket. The most powerful players. Mixed Flux. No one's ever tried it before. There's no telling what kind of power that will produce. The sphere was the key from the beginning. I should have known. It will lead us straight to Blaylock. Once the ambassador is safe, we'll return to Genesis. We'll find him. Right, Sonny. Hop, hop, hop. On the left. Hop. On the right. Hop, 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 hop. <laughs> it's not as easy as it looks. <laughs> Goal over your moon ambassador. <laughs> <Dark>. <laughs> You should leave that to our talented daughter. <laughs> what an amazing place! Look at these flowers! You know I love you. This is who I am now. I'm sorry. <gasps> I didn't mean to scare you. Are you all settled in? I'm fine, Artie, thank you. How do you really feel? I'm on a pirate ship. Rocket has left, and my parents are in prison. Any more questions? <laughs> you're not just with any pirates, you're with Sonny Blackbone, so don't worry. Sonny will take care of everything, you'll see. I don't believe that any one person can take care of everything. Sonny can. Hardy, you're very easy to find, because you're never where you're supposed to be. Uh, <laughs> in the kitchen, or I'll tell Sonny to jettison you with the trash. I'll be right there. <laughs> Coming soon, Snow Kids versus Breakers. Don't dare miss it. Don't have a heart attack. Our Tagor's coming. No. Okay, everyone. Let me have your attention. Gather round. I've got some good news. Today's gonna be a little different. You're gonna have some technical assistance for the rest of the competition. I'd like to introduce the new assistant coach of the Snow Kids, Artigor Nexus. Hello, Snow Kids. Artegor? 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 It can't be. Whoa, what's going on? What's, what's he, he doing, doing here? Artegor Nexus here? Pinch me. I'm dreaming. Ow! It's an expression. Okay, let's calm down. Without the smog, Artegor is coming back to his old self. He's a good friend. I'm honored to have him with us. The honor is mine, Arch. I know what you're thinking. What does this guy know? But if there's one person in the galaxy who knows the strengths and weaknesses of the Snow Kids, it's me. Yeah, but it didn't help the shadows much. Jock, listen up. I want all of you to give Artegor your support. You'll find that his help will be very valuable to the team. The first thing I'm asking him to do is work with you, Mark. What? I expect you to do exactly as he says. That goes for all of you. Where's Tia? She knows we have practice. May, what do you know about this? I... I'm not sure, but she didn't sleep in her room last night. Simbai, did she come to visit you last night? No, Arch. May, are you sure you don't know anything? I think she might have left with Sonny Blackbones and his pirates. 
What? Tia's with my father? She left with the pirates in the middle of... Oh, yeah. I did that once. Tia knows that her parents are being held in a technoid prison without charges. It's completely unfair. Sonny's gonna help her. But how did you find my dad? This doesn't make any sense. I brought her to Sonny. What? But how? Jock, I know Corso. He came to me to find out how you were doing. He did it for Sonny. So my dad was spying on me. He wasn't spying on you. He was protecting you. May, we need Tia for the next match against the Rikers. I understand it's her parents, but... When will she be back? I have no idea, Coach. Unfortunately, we don't have a replacement for her position. What about her? She could play for Tia. Huh? I need Yuki in case Ahito is not strong enough since his illness. I'm a goalkeeper, sir, not a midfielder. I just can't change positions. Everyone can change. What matters is that you're a footballer. I can teach you how to attack. Let's do it. Take your positions and no slacking. Remember? Mm -hmm. yes. cool. The drill is simple. Mark, you'll steal the ball from the clones behind the red line. goals you can. Yeah, yeah. Got it, everybody? Got it. Yeah, I got it. Yeah, yeah, sure. Sure. Yeah, sure. Okay, yeah. Then get a move on. Hey! Mark, chin on your chest, head in line, and balance with the ball. Then you find the power and control. Acts like you have the ball already. This had better work. You should always be positioned so you can hit the ball downwards as hard as possible. Use your forehead and never take your eyes off the ball. Got it? Easy for you to say. Because it's easy to do. You just need a bit of skill and a lot of willpower. Let's try again. I'd rather let the clone try. Need replacing. You just asked me to add salt. Hey, do you need anything? No, no. I just came to see if I could help. Mmm, what are you cooking? It smells. Uh, blue? Taste it. This human thinks it needs salt. I have the best taste downloads in the galaxy. It's great. 
Nice. Just like mom's. You might meet her soon. My sensor tell me that you hate it. He's the only cook on board. We've gotten used to it. Well, if you think you could do better, be my guest. Centering the ball. Are you okay? I'm far from okay. Yuki, get up. If you're not good enough, then get off the field. Ah! I am good enough. I'm a snow kid. You hear me? I'm a snow kid. Then I expect you to act like one. Is that clear enough for you? me more every day I think I'm in love again I'm not surprised your nature is to make mistakes microwise huh? <laughs> hey. yes sir I understand I just couldn't find the right angle until you insisted you found the right angle Yuki you just don't believe in yourself because you're afraid I'm going to teach you how to go even further it looks like a complete recovery. What do you think? He's taking his new role very seriously. It's just like when we were teammates. You know, Simbai, I found an old friend. I really missed him. Are you so mad at me? Huh? No. I know Sonny wants the best for me. He's just a bit awkward at being a dad, though. I guess he hasn't had much practice. I do get the feeling that I'm the only one who wants to win this cup. Why do you say that? Well, with Rocket and Tia gone, soon there'll be no one else left to play. Not to mention having our Tagor breathing down our necks. Is that clear enough for you? We're still a team. You can count on me. I'll never leave you. I know, May. If you did leave me, I could always have Sonny track you down. You see, having a pirate in the family is handy. <laughs> well, let's see what the robot cooked us up for lunch. So, you finally decided to cook for humans, eh? The girl did stop me. I quit. I want to remind you that I was programmed to repair engines. I'm a great mechanic. That's possibly the best meal I've ever tasted. Mmm, it's really delicious. Hey, you can stay as long as you like. You can thank my nanny, Stella. She taught me everything I know. Can't she fix a hybrid turbine thruster while in space? I can. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I hurt everywhere. Even my hair hurts. That was an intense practice. But Artegor's not such a bad guy after all, is he? We have enough problems without him. Maybe more with him. As long as he doesn't toss the net on us. Well, I'm off to see Yuki to give her a little professional advice about being a striker. Not 
knock. Ah! Wow! Don't scare me like that. I mean, um, sir? Sorry I startled you, Mike Rice. I've come to see your captain, Jock. Yeah, he's all yours. I'm out of here. See you when I see you. What did you want to tell me? I know you're not very happy that I'm the new assistant coach since we've had our little differences in the past. And what? Am I supposed to forgive you? When Arch and I were young, we were a lot like you and Microice. We were inseparable and full of dreams. We played football every second. We were certain we'd be superstars one day. Touching. Don't forget that I was also a kid from a Killian who dreamed of playing galactic football. But like you, I was stubborn. I didn't listen to anyone but myself, and I lost my way. If you listen to me, I might spare you that pain. Why would you do that? I'm here to help you, and maybe redeem myself a bit along the way. You understand? You'll always be a kid from Achillion. Don't forget it. I'll see you at practice. Sonny Blackbones, the most wanted pirate in the galaxy. I've come to turn myself in. Huh? What? Sonny? Next time on Galactic Football. Tally, it appears Rocket is not suiting up to play today. Tia is also not on the field. I expect all of you to concentrate on nothing other than the match. This is a quarterfinals match. That's it, Yuki. Don't panic. Pass to Jock. Now! Excuse me, I'm looking for one of the Snow Kids. Tia? Artie, are you hurt? Don't move, or you'll join him. 